what's happening today i'm ice fishing a pond for some bass all right i'm at this pond that i've been to before and i'm trying to get that ice bass um but i just drilled a hole in some stuff up here and it looks like a school of perch so i'm gonna, I'm gonna get down there and try to get one of these the ice isn't great here it's not thick but it's not thin either it's about four inches here comes something looking at me Yep. Got him, got him. Oh, that's a bass. That's definitely a bass. That's not bad. Please don't break. I need my drag to work. I think that's a bass. Oh, please work, drag. Loosen up a bit. That's a bass. That's gotta be a bass. Oh, finally, and I got it on camera. Come on, drag. There we go. Oh, that's a bass. That's totally a bass. Come on. Yeah, that's a big one. Oh my gosh. I finally got my first large mouth out of the ice. I've broken off on one and I've lost one. And I fished, they both happened at this pond. And I finally got my freaking large mouth and I just got here. Oh yes, I feel so accomplished. Oh my God. And I got it on my crappy rod with bad drag. That's a good fish. That's 15 and a quarter. Wow. Gosh. Look at that. Finally got me that large mouth. I've always wanted that. Whew. All right, let's get a good release on this beautiful fish. There it goes. Whew. I did it. Oh, I found him. Yes. <laughs> Wow, I am straight up giddy after catching that bass. You know, that bass wasn't too hard to hook. He was four feet off the bottom and was just starting to rise when he saw my jig. Really slow rise, but almost like a really big, slow perch kind of thing. Oh, that was crazy. Just walked over this hole and I see something down there. Let's see if I can get it. Yeah, it's coming up. It's coming up. Probably a perch. They're all over me. Here comes one. Got, oh, that was definitely a perch. <laughs> that was really small. Here he comes. Got him. Oh, oh, I got him. Oh, he's so small. I, <laughs> I didn't think I had a fish on. All right, got the bass and I got a little perch. Oh. He's a fat guy. He's not big, but he's fat at least. See ya. All right, well, at least I found the school that wants to eat. Oh, there's a fish. Come on. Go oh, <laughs> yeah, that was a definitely a little perch. Got him. Oh, is he on? Yeah, he's on. I got a perch. <laughs> oh, this is one of the nicest perch I've caught out of here. Whew. That fish was not responding on the bottom. And as soon as I just went up to try higher up, it just stormed up and chased me. <laughs> it was weird. That's awesome. Yeah, this is one of the nicer perch I've caught out of here. I mean, it's longer, but it's kind of skinny. Perch fish. Let's give this perch a nice release. There he goes. <laughs> Here comes something. Go. Oh. oh, I had him. Had him. They're coming up again. Here they come. Got, oh my god, I had him again. Got, oh my god, I waited too long on that one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Got him. Oh man, drag super loose. Not a bad perch. All right. 
I mean, I know it's a small perch, but for here it's like not a terrible one. It's actually one of the bigger ones. <laughs> Did you hear that drag? That's why this rod's just garbage. Well, the reel is. The rod's, eh. For panfish, it's okay, but. Yep, one back. I think I have a bass on the screen here. Whatever it is, is looking right at my lure. I don't know if it's a bass. And now here comes another one from the bottom. Is it a perch? The other one's leaving. Huh. Interesting. Well, there is a storm blowing in this afternoon. Yeah, it's starting to get pretty cold out here. Uh, we're supposed to get some snow here and and yeah, I'm glad I got a few fish. So I might I might leave soon. I'm just gonna try this hole for a little bit. A little bit. See if I can get another perch. Maybe luck out with the bass. We'll see. And what do you know? There's a perch down there. And they're coming up to check it out. Yep, here it comes. Got him. Got him. Oh, that feels better. Oh, I got another bass. Yes. Oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> I came here to cross off the largemouth bass for my list and I got a second one. All right. I knew that felt bigger than a ye average perch. Look at that. There's what I got on the atomic, what's it called, with the ding-a-lings on the side. You know, the doohickey. Jeez. Right on the top of the mouth. Oh, Roy Got another bass. So happy about that. Right as I was about to leave, I'm probably going to stay here a little longer then. <laughs> All right, see you later, little buddy. Boom. <laughs> Sweet. I could not be happier with that. Three perch and two bass. Yeah, buddy. All right. The color of the day has been chartreuse and kind of bright green. Caught a lot, a lot, most of my fish on that color. And I think I caught one on a pink Swedish pimple, one perch. But the bass were both on green things. That first bigger one was on a little green thing with the tail. <laughs> it kind of looked like a rat, so, but it's a different brand. Very small. Very small green jig with a tail. All right, if I could get another fish, it'd be cool, but I'll probably go pretty soon either way. I've heard that bass on the ice kind of school up, and if you find one, you know, keep looking around there, you might find another one, which makes sense why they're so hard to find in the winter. But hopefully that's true, and there's another one right next to me. That'd be that'd be pretty cool. Man, the scenery is crazy. Look at the sky. All the clouds. The storm's definitely rolling in. Got him. Got him. Birch. All right. Hey. Another one of this size. That might be the biggest of the day. That one's actually kind of fat. Cool. All right, well, I think that last perch was my last fish. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna pack up and go. It's getting pretty cold. Uh, storm's gonna roll through soon. And I'm just ready to go home. I'm, I'm satisfied I caught two of the target species, the largemouth bass. And I caught, what, four perch, I think? Um, not terrible perch either, but not big ones. Uh, and, you know, it's probably one of the last times I'll be able to fish this pond that I like um, because the ice is melting. Uh, there's even some open water over there. I did it. Caught some bass out of the pond.
Then you got this side of the pond with open water in the corner. Don't worry folks, I'm being safe. You got at least four inches over there. Open water here. Next pond over, all open. Just goes to show every, every little pond and lake is totally different and freezes at a different rate.